Cain and Abel. Bible Stories. Thousands of years ago, in a remote time in human history, when the world was young and civilization was just beginning to emerge, there lived a family that would change the destiny of humanity forever. Adam and Eve, the first human beings created by God, had been blessed with two sons, Cain, the firstborn, and Abel, the youngest. From an early age, the two brothers showed very different personalities. Cain, with a strong and determined character, was attracted to the earth and its fruits. He worked hard in the fields, tilling the land and caring for the crops with dedication. He was a man of action, full of ambition and determination to achieve God's favor. On the other hand, Abel, the youngest of the family, was a calmer and more contemplative soul. He was attracted to nature and the lives of animals. He spent hours caring for and herding his flock of sheep, with a special connection with the animals around him. He always showed sincere devotion to God, being grateful for the blessings they received. When the time came to make offerings to God, both brothers felt the responsibility to present their gifts. Cain, with his entrepreneurial spirit, decided to offer the fruits of his work in the field, while Abel, with his pure and life-loving heart, chose to present the first lambs born from his flock. When it came time to evaluate the offerings, God looked with favor on Abel's presentation. He recognized the sincerity of his heart and the gratitude he showed in his offering. However, he did not show the same acceptance toward Cain's offering. This generated a feeling of resentment and jealousy in the heart of Cain, who could not understand why his gift was not received with the same divine favor. Instead of reflecting on his attitude and correcting his mistake, Cain allowed anger and envy to take over him. One day, while both brothers were in the field, Cain approached Abel and angrily confronted him. He told him that if he were more obedient and devout like him, God would also accept his offerings. Abel tried to calm his brother, explaining to her that God looks into the heart and that each person must present his offerings with sincerity and gratitude. But Abel's words only fueled Cain's rage. In a fit of jealousy and resentment, Cain struck his brother again and again, until Abel was left lifeless. When God approached the place and asked for Abel, Cain lied, saying that he did not know where he was. But God, who knows everything that happens in the universe, knew the truth and saw the malice in Cain's heart. Then, God condemned Cain for his crime and warned him that the blood of his brother cried out from the ground. Sorrow and guilt flooded Cain's soul as he realized the extent of his heinous act. He begged God to forgive him, but the mark of his crime was already imprinted on him. God told him that he would wander the earth as a fugitive and that he would never find peace. He also warned that anyone who found Cain might try to kill him. Cain, overcome with sadness and remorse, went into exile carrying with him the burden of his sin and the heavy loss of his brother. He felt alone and desperate, but God, in his mercy, put a sign on Cain to protect him from any revenge that he wanted to take his life. The story of Cain and Abel is a story that highlights the devastating consequences of uncontrolled envy and jealousy. It teaches us the importance of reflecting on our emotions and actions, and how we can be victims of our own weaknesses if we do not control our negative impulses. It is a reminder of the importance of presenting our offerings and actions with sincerity and gratitude towards God and others, without being carried away by envy or the desire to surpass others. The story of Cain and Abel leaves us with a timeless lesson about the responsibility of our choices and how they can affect our lives and the lives of those around us.